Hi, Scorpio. Welcome to my channel. This is your reading for the next week. Let's see. What do we have for you? Happy New Year, Scorpio. I wish you the best. It's a general reading, so take as it resonates and leave the rest. I do offer personal readings, Scorpio. If you're interested, check the description box below. Your first card, it's a very positive card. Abundance coming for you next week. With the flowers, represents happiness, a gift, an invitation. What do you need to focus? If you're single, there is a new love offer, maybe a Libra. There is a lot of communication between you two. This person is also very honest. Okay. It's going to bring balance in your life, Scorpio. Let's see your focus. There is passion between you two. This person sees you very attractive. You're bold, assertive, confident, Scorpio. It's like a soulmate connection. There is feelings and emotion between you two. This person is also very different from your usual type, Scorpio. It's you like taking a risk about relationship. But you don't see coming strong Libra energy here. Receiving what you deserve, Scorpio. Let's see. Message for you. There is a dark woman around you. I feel like this person is a friend of yours. She's going to give you some advice. The scales are showing up again. Keep your life in balance. Increase your effort if you want to achieve your goals. This guy is telling me just keep trying. Stay strong. Don't give up. You are almost a Scorpio. What do you need to know? Let's see. I can see a significant message. Some good news coming for you next week. And the total energy. Just you need to be a little bit more patient with yourself. It's about slowly, okay? Protective energy. Slow and steady wins the race. Let's see. We challenge next week, Scorpio. There is a significant legal mother of a life. Some of you have been waiting for a divorce, a marriage, okay? A fight, a conflict between you and someone is going to end very soon here. You can have justice showing up three times, okay? Justice is on your side as you're receiving an important message or document here, something official or a contract. It's going to change everything. See you, animal spirit, for the next week. Stop here. Now it's a lucky time. It's a rabbit spirit. Just be careful with this energy, represent also fertility. Opportunity to get pregnant for some of you. But your finances, everything is going to be okay. It's a lucky energy here. An advice. Taurus energy. You can be proud of yourself. Scorpio. You're someone a little bit stubborn with Taurus showing up, but working really hard to take care of your family. It's the most important thing for you. Let's see. Three cards about relationship. You love life, Scorpio. To be happy. Let's see. We have Libra, Gemini, Aquarius here. And some of you, you're dealing with someone in a different country. So there is distance between you two, a long distance relationship here. 
but it's like your destiny to be with this person. Strong towards energy also with a high love and so forth. Just for some of you, you're going to get married with this person in the near future. So there is an opportunity showing up here. Okay. Let's see. With the Knight of Swords. We have the Five of Swords. Yes, stress and preoccupation from your person because there is distance between it. With the world, we have justice again. Definitely there is a significant Libra around you. Okay. The Eight of Pentacles is telling me that you really focus on your career. You don't have time for your love life, Scorpio. With judgment, you don't want to repeat the same mistakes. You are on the right path about relationship, your love life here. It's a big transformation. Time for you to be happy again. Okay. Can see communication between you and someone. You are a little bit protective because you have children around you. Protecting your family, your finances, Scorpio. I can see an important meeting between you two. It's you spending time together, dating, going out. It's about destiny. We have destiny cards showing up twice here. Okay, with a high love fund. It's about having faith. Okay. If you're dealing with someone, I really feel like it's the right person for you. Scorpio, okay? After a long period of being single, a single parent, I feel like this person definitely is going to bring balance in your life. Let's see what's going on about your money, career and finances. I see you working really hard next week, Scorpio. We have the Three of Swords, the Five of Swords, and the Emmy card. You're working on your home, at home here. Very independent energy here. With the Three of Swords, it's the end of a contract, a partnership. You can see a confrontation between you and someone, okay? The best you can do is to defend yourself, your point of view, your idea. Let's see what is showing up for you, Scorpio. There is a significant change in your career. With the Tree of Swords, we have the Moon and the High Princess. You're very intuitive. For some of you, you have psychic abilities, Scorpio. Okay? With the Moon, you need to trust your intuition, your instinct. Important for you to face in your fears. You need to believe in yourself, okay? To have success in your life. What's going on about this meeting, this confrontation between you and a feminine energy? It's like a transition. Can we talking about a relocation? I see you moving very soon here, but not alone. There is people around you, or someone from your family. Leaving everything behind, your past, rural stress, and city to have a free start in your career. Defending yourself. There is a lot of competition, but there is a positive outcome. You can realize your dream, Scorpio. Let's see. Just you need to increase your effort. Money is coming, okay, with a fish energy. Transforming your life. You're going to do something very different from your past. You're taking a risk in your career. Fighting about something, okay? Big transformation in your career, Scorpio. End of a cycle. 
and don't waste them more. Let's see. I feel like you are a single mom. You're working really hard every day to take care of yourself, of your family. You can be proud. Scorpio, what gets you very independent, not giving up. Can be a good idea for you to spend time in nature, around animals, to heal, to have strength again. I feel like you're facing difficulties about your finances. No cap. But there is a key over there. The key represents opportunities. Stop waiting and take actions. No cap. If you're looking for a job, don't give up. Keep trying. It's you leaving something, a relationship, a situation, a job behind. Choosing yourself. There is a sun over there. It's a new light. Hope coming for you. Very good helping also. You're so caring and generous, Scorpio. Very positive energy. And there is someone romantic around you. I see you receiving a gift, a love offer from this person. Oh, this person is going to bring you a lot of happiness, Scorpio. Scorpio, this is your reading. Thank you so much for watching and being here. Happy New Year. Take care. Bye.